My name is Jimmy. What's up, you guys? Jimmy here with a review for the very first episode of the new show, Hannibal. And this episode is entitled Aperitif. In this episode, um, the FBI works on a case of missing college girls. So, uh, Detective Jack Crawford, he recruits Will Graham to um, help him on the case. But uh, Jack also seeks Dr. Hannibal Lecter, who is a brilliant psychiatrist. And we know him as uh, one of the most successful one of the most successful serial killers of all time. And a cannibal. So, yeah, and um, when a copycat strikes, both uh, Will and Hannibal join forces to take him down. Um, this episode, uh, it was very intriguing. Interesting. Uh, I've never watched any of the Hannibal stuff, so I'm, I'm definitely going to watch the Hannibal stuff ASAP. But usually uh, on some shows, uh, it takes me a couple episodes. But this, just one episode's got me really interested in it. And uh, from what I heard in the novel Red Dragon, um, that Graham actually met Hannibal while he was investigating a series of murders and quickly finds out that Lecter was the, the killer and... Uh, takes him down, but it seems like this show is going to be putting more of a relationship between the two, which I think that's going to be very interesting. Uh, it it make uh, the possibility of multiple seasons. Kind of like how Smallville had a relationship building with Lex Luthor and Clark. It, it's uh, interesting to see that in another show. And like I said, I will watch those Hannibal movies, even Silence of the Lambs, and the other part of uh, adaptation for <clears throat> Red Dragon. And uh, the one thing I thought was very cool when he was like looking at the murder scene, and uh, it, the way he was visualizing, he's visualizing like it was him. I guess that's like how he uh, sees how 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 it went down in this uh, area. I mean, not area in the crime scene, which I thought that was pretty, pretty cool. It's it, it, I think that's original. I've never seen that on a show. I've seen you know, them putting scenarios in the CSI, but not like this. So that very is very interesting, and uh, I actually look forward to more shows I would say um, for a, a procedural show, this is actually really good. I gotta say, I, I look forward to seeing what uh, happens in the future of the this season, which this show gets a total of 13 episodes. And uh, from what I read, when they each season, when it gets renewed, when and if it gets renewed, it'll be 13 episodes. So... I mean, I think it's a really cool show, and if you're into this type of stuff, I, I would suggest you uh, you give this uh, show a shot. And uh, like I've said in the past, if uh, there's upcoming or returning TV shows that you think that might be interested, give me some suggestions for stuff. And uh, like I've said before, later this uh, year in... Uh, June, actually. Not later this year, in a couple months. In June, I will be reviewing Season 3 of Teen Wolf. Because I really am into that show. So, uh, that's it for my review. Uh, but for more news and reviews on movies, video games, comics, and more, you can go to bkbn.net and celebrate your nerdum in a big way. I'm Jimmy. Until next time, bye.